Oh, check out how wide this angle is. Widescreen. Yeah, at least I can actually see myself and frame it properly now. That's pretty good. Can I actually zoom in? Just testing out my Canon G7X. Definitely gonna try this out a little bit. Um, I'm gonna show you what I had before. It's a bit dark in here. It's still nice and bright. So I'm gonna retire this iPhone 7, I believe it is, um, and test out the G7X. Bye bye. Not using you again. Oh, okay. Are you ready? Yeah. I gotta get some stuff for me. Uh, yeah, let's go get her. Swimming. Amy's swimming clothing. Swimming costume, I should say. It's got a Manfrotto uh, pixie tripod, Canon G7X, and a flip out screen. It is about 42 degrees outside. Oh my lord. Woo! Feel the heat. Oh, this metal burns. Oh. Jesus Christ. It was like 42 before, so it's actually calmed down a bit. Check out the damn temperature. Look, who's this one? Hi, Molly. Hi, Baba. Hello. You ready to go? We're going to go swimming. You ready? You pretty one. Very, very hot. Are you happy? Okay, let's We're go. We're going to swimming pool. You're turning. Oh. Yeah, you're turning. Oh, <laughs> that's right. It's about dusk, so six o'clock. Sun's about to set over there. Um, Quite strong direct sunlight into my face. Maybe direct sunlight into the camera. So far, it's coping very well. I can say it's at least from the screen that I can see, it's very, very beautiful. I keep looking at the screen, so I'm not looking at the lens. Um, so far, so good. I've taken a few B rolls, um, but I'll probably try to do a time lapse of the sunset and and see what the quality is like compared to the iPhone 7. Hopefully, it's a lot better because this has costed me about five, six hundred dollars for this camera. This thing is so good. actually a uh, video mode that we can use which uh, obviously a lot works a lot better than the, the standard mode that I've been using. Does this autofocus? Oh yeah, lighting's pretty good. Look at that! Auto lighting indoors. It's like a mean tone man. Can you see why you like side top? And then um, it will be just like eating in the shafts. And we're reheating the soup. Now you don't want to overcook this. So once you put it in, you have to separate the beef really quickly. You want it to be still succulent. Right here. the coolest Lego collection you can ever see. Check this out. Dude, this oh. is Can you please and take then, a look? Wait, you're the same whisper. It's like, 
Jacqueline, Amy, and Nessie. Bobby was just like, from Ghana, from Ghana. He was really cute back then. Oh, these guys are looking at some old school. But I'll hold one first. Okay. Old school Yay! sticker photos. Like these? When was this done? When was this done? A wedding. A wedding. This was done at their wedding six, uh, five, six years ago. Oh, that's their wedding photos. What? Is this a sticker photo? Just a sticker photo, sorry, no waiting for it, sir. Let me just focus this thing. Real world, real world usage of Canon G7X. The verdict for today, at least. Um, it's been good. I mean, the, the image quality is very good. The, the focusing is very, very slow. And that, that's like, look, show you. It's a, it's a steady, it's a steady focus compared to, I think, the um, RX100, the Sony. Um, supposedly that has a super fast focus. I, I, I don't have it so I can't really try but um, that's something that I'm starting to get used to or trying to get used to when I'm trying to focus on something that's smaller or not that far away um, the autofocus doesn't work, the manual focus is a bit fiddly, the ring doesn't turn as well um, but other than that the colors are very good, it's very vibrant um, the controls I'm still trying to get used to so that'll take a couple more days uh, but in terms of comparing that to the iPhone 7. This is much, much better image quality. Um, audio, I'm not sure yet. I'll have to go go post to see how that goes, but at least compared to the iPhone, the, the image quality is much better. It, low light, you can't, nothing. It's nothing compared. Um, uh, iPhone is nothing compared to um, the G7X. So definitely recommend it. I'll give it another week or two of vlogging and see how it goes. It's a lot, it's very light. Um, the thing that iPhone has, that this doesn't is that the iPhone is much lighter. I can just take it off um, uh, the, the Manfrotto Pixie Mini tripod um, and just use it by handheld, and then I can film whatever I want. Whereas this one, um, I guess I can do the same thing, but the whole thing combined together is really heavy and clunky and kind of makes you want to think do you want to bring this out? Uh, whereas you have your phone all the time, but um, time will tell. So we'll, we'll continue to use this. Hopefully the B-roll all turns out well. Um, and if the editor had helped me cut some of my kind of crappy ranting, um, that's it. So that's it for this video. I don't have anything else to say. Okay, I, I just reviewed the uh, view footage directly on the G7 ca X camera. Um, I've noticed the focus just goes kind of pulses in and out. I have no idea why it does that. Obviously, it's on autofocus. Um, I think I have to figure out how to lock the focus uh, to prevent that from happening. But it's it's a pain in the ass. If I'm just you know having a talking head like now, um, I want things to just autofocus properly um, without me doing too much. So it, it's kind of annoying how it just kind of pulses and zooms in and out and does that weird focusing thing. Um, it might be just my sitting, it might be just I'm, I'm crap at using this. So hopefully give it a couple more days. I'll read the menu. I've never done that before. I might have to read, read the menu to figure out how to use it properly um, and then get that fixed. All right, then we're gonna crack open the 18. This will be good. Live it, maybe, 15. Oh, cheetah. Shot skull, skull glasses. Good to chill. Some nice whiskeys. I love our whiskeys.